Hello guys, so today's video is about the ultrasound of sacrococcygeal teratoma, which is a review from the book Requisites of Ultrasound. A sacrococcygeal teratoma is a neoplasm that extends from the fetal rump and it has all the three germ cell layers. A sacrococcygeal teratoma can be of varying sizes. It can either be small, large or medium sized and it appearance can either be cystic or solid or it can be mixed cystic and solid. On ultrasound, the sacrococcygeal teratoma is near to the sacrum and coccyx and it may be predominantly internal or external or both and the spinal element is normal. There is no disruption in the spinal element. Most sacrococcygeal teratomas are benign but if they present later in the gestation, the likelihood of malignancy is high. Blood flow in the mass can be prominent and occasionally causes high output cardiac failure and high drops. The mass can substantially grow during the gestation and so its size should be measured on the ultrasound examination. In this image you can see that there is a fetus at 18 weeks gestation with a normal spine and it shows a large mixed cystic and solid mass which is extending quarterly from the level of the distal spine. You must note that the spine is normal. Here is another image of sacrococcygeal teratoma. It is indicated by the large arrow and you can see it is extending quarterly from the level of the distal spine. Here is another image of sacrococcygeal teratoma. You can see the normally tapering sacral spine with no evidence of spinal abnormality. The sacrococcygeal teratoma is again seen indicated by the long arrow. So this sums up my video. I really hope you like this video. Please subscribe to my channel and inshallah I will come up with more such content. Thank you.